The city's restaurants are a magnet for influencers, posting pics and videos of their meals on the gram. Yeah, in fact, some restaurants even offer comps in exchange for the publicity, but it's Fox 5 Stephanie Bertini shows us that could all be changing. Inside Reverence, a fine dining restaurant in Harlem, there's a strict rule. We have a no technology policy. That means no pictures, no posting on social media, and when it comes to influencers, chef and owner Russell Jackson is not interested. The aspect of influencers having or ha having expectations or wanting to, you know, dying for free in your restaurant, the restaurant business, as we all know, has suffered immensely. It's no secret that pre and post pandemic influencers have been and are comped meals in exchange for their social media clout and some don't mind at all. Doesn't bother me. I love when I see people enjoying themselves. It makes me feel like it's a good restaurant. There are those who say it's disruptive. That's why inside Carriage House NYC no flash or video during dining hours. It says so on the menu. Flash photography can be very distracting to other people. But influencers and the social media savvy have have their place in here. There's moments for that. We're reserving like before opening for influencer and posts like that. Staten Island's Danny Mondello or Cougine on social media has gained a huge following on TikTok and Instagram. The food influencer says he's usually welcomed by the owners of the food places he features. No one really was uh, against me making a video. They always prefer me making a video. He says restaurant owners now wanting this kind of attention is not the norm in his experience. It's definitely odd and different in today's age. But here at Reverence, it is the norm. The chef and owner wants no distractions. And for patrons like these, it's embraced. You know, my wife is a big fan of taking pictures of food and I'm, I'm, I'm always a little bit embarrassed. And I love the idea that like when you sit down and eat, you're actually just kind of paying attention to the food. The it's the rare exception now that walks in and says, oh, I have to use my phone versus those that thank us for doing what we're doing. Stephanie Bertini, Fox 5 News.